Once a scoundrel and a thief, living up to the typing stereotypes, Mavros thought himself untouchable by the authorities. This, however, was short-lived. The price he paid for his crime was his arm. As further punishment for his crimes, he was sent to a secluded portion of the Cliff Keep Mountains of Teldore to remain in solitude within a cell of stone. Inevitably, this gave him much time to think and reflect on his ways. After many months alone, a mysterious earthquake hit the region, causing a wall of his cell to collapse. Behind was a hidden tunnel with a soft light pulsating from within. As he drew closer, he instinctively reached for the light with the hand he had lost. As he did, the light grew stronger and pulsed with ancient energy. As the light subsided, the source was nowhere to be seen. But where his stump used to be was an intricate prosthetic, wielding a golden blade sword that pulsed with the same energy he reached for. Within his mind was a voice, one that spoke with curiosity and wisdom. This deity offered him redemption. In return, Mavros must show this deity what it means to be mortal, what it means to live like those who roam Alexandria in all its glory.
Thank you very much for watching. If you like what you see, don't forget to like and subscribe and follow me on Instagram at Nathan underscore Paul 1998 and my Twitter at Nathan underscore J underscore Paul. See you next time for more character designs, redesigns and commissions.